Good morning, I'm Mark Gant and let's talk about minors and cofactors. So for the learning objectives, at the end of the video lecture, the students are expected to first understand the difference of minors and cofactors. Second, pin down the ways to obtain minors and cofactors. Third, identify the correlation between minors and cofactors. And last, know the importance of minor and cofactors in the concept of the major step. So, let's get started! First is the concepts. Minor. Minor of an element in a matrix is defined as the determinant obtained by deleting the row and column in which that element lies. Sa madaling salita, makukuha natin ng minor by deleting the entire row and column kung saan nakalagay yung element. Cofactor. A cofactor is the number you get when you remove the column and row of a designated element in a matrix, which is just a numerical grid in the form of rectangle or a square. So the difference between the cofactor and minor is that they are actually the same, it's just that the cofactor is assigned minor. Let's move to the examples. So for the first example, it is about obtaining the minors. So we have here 3 by 3 matrix and we are asked to get the minor of A11, A22, and A13. So paano nga ba natin makukuha ang minor? Gaya nga nasabi ko kanina, makukuha natin ang minor by deleting the entire row and column in which the element lies. So yung remaining elements doon, yun ang magiging minor. Para makuha ang minor ng A11, kailangan natin i-delete ang entire row at column nito. So as you can see, deleted na ang first row at first column. Ang natitirang elements na lang ay A22, A23, A32, A33. Yun ang magiging minor. Para sa minor ng A22 at A13, same process lang kagaya ng sinabi ko kanina. I-delete ang entire row at column kung saan ito nakalagay at kung ano yung titirang elements, yun ang magiging minor. So bago tayo mag-proceed sa example about cofactor, please take note that the cofactor of the element Aij in any determinant of order M is that signed minor by Aij is equal to negative 1 raised to i plus j times the minor, whereas i as the row number and j as the column number. So ito yung magiging formula natin for getting the cofactor. Please take note of that. For example number 2, same given lang siya as the example number 1. Pero dito, ang kukunin natin ay cofactors. Gaya nga nang sabi ko kanina, cofactors and minors are actually the same. It's just that the cofactors are signed minors. Para makuha ang cofactor ng A11, kailangan natin gamitin ang formula for cofactors which is equal to negative 1 raised to row number plus column number times the minor. Since kinukuha natin ang cofactor ng A11, ang row number nito ay 1 at ang column number nito ay 1. So substitute lang natin sa binigay na formula. So Aij is equal to negative 1 raised to 1 plus 1 times the minor. So paano ba natin makukuha yung minor? Makukuha natin ang minor by deleting the entire row at column kung saan ito nakalagay. So sa case na to, dinilit natin ang entire row at column ng A11. So ang nagtitirang elements sa lamang ay A22, A23, A32, at A33. Yun ang magiging minor mo. So para makuha yung cofactor, ito times mo to sa negative 1 raised to 1 plus 1, which is positive 1. So ang cofactor ng A11 ay ang A22, A23, A32, at A33. Napansin nyo guys, hindi nagbago yung sign niya. Kasi ang exponent niya ay even. Magiging negative lamang ito kapag ang exponent niya ay nakaraise sa odd numbers. Kasi negative 1 raised to odd number is still negative 1. Recap lang, makukuha natin ang exponent nito kapag pinag plus natin ang row number plus the column number. Para naman sa cofactor ng A22 at A13, same process lang din. Kung napapansin nyo, positive sila kasi ang exponent nila ay even. Ang exponent ng A22 ay 4. Ang exponent ng A13 ay 4. So, positive ang cofactor nito. So, for example number 3, para mas maintindihan pa natin ang concept ng binary cofactors, we have a formula of a determinant 3 by 3 matrix here, first row as the reference. As you can see, ayun na yung formula para makuha ang determinant ng 3 by 3 matrix. So, pag natin sila. So, nung pinag natin sila, makikita nyo yung difference ng minor and cofactor. Yung minor, na-obtain siya by deleting the entire row and column kung saan nakalagay yung element. While yung cofactor naman ay yung 
negative 1 times the row number plus column number times the minor. Sabi ko nga kanina, ang cofactor ay ang side minor. So for the last example, we are given here a 3 by 3 matrix. We are asked to get the minor and cofactor of A11, A21, and A22. So to obtain the minor of the A11, we have to delete the entire row and column of it. So in the elements ay negative 5, 6, 8, and negative 9. So by basket method, we can obtain the minor of A11, which is negative 3. So to obtain the minor of A12 and A22, same process lang sa ginawa natin kanina. We have to delete the entire row and column. Ang yung natirang elements, yun ang magiging minor mo. Then by basket method, we can obtain the answer. So, ang minor ng A12 ay negative 78 at ang minor naman ng A22 ay 12. So, for cofactors, we can use this formula given earlier, Aij is equal to negative 1 raised to i plus j times the minor. Whereas i is the row number and j is the column number. So, kanina, nasolve na natin yung minor. So, ang titingnan na lang natin ay yung row number at column number. Sa A11, ang row number niya ay 1 at ang column number niya ay 1. So, negative 1 raised to 2 ay positive 1. So, positive 1 times so negative 3 is still negative 3. Sa A12, ang row number niya ay 1 at ang column number niya ay 2. So, negative 1 raised to 3 ay negative 1. Negative 1 times negative 78 ay positive 78. So guys, kung makikita nyo, yung minor niya ay negative 78 at ang cofactor niya ay 78. Gaya nga, nasabi ko kanina, ang cofactor ay ang signed minor. So since, add ang exponent niya, magbabago ang kanyang sign. Lastly, for the cofactor of A22, ang row number niya ay 2 at ang column number niya ay 2. So negative 1 raised to 4 is 1. 1 times 12 is 12. For the key points about this topic, the difference between cofactor and minor is that the minor of an element of a square matrix is the determinant that we get by deleting the row and column in which the element appears. The cofactor of an element of a square matrix is the minor of the element with a proper sign. So please take note of this formula for cofactor. Aij is equal to negative 1 raised to i plus j times the minor, whereas i is the row number and j is the column number. For the importance, minors and cofactors are two of the most important concepts in matrices as they are crucial in finding the adjoint and the inverse of a matrix. To find the determinants of a large square matrix like 4x4, four four, it is important to find the minors of that matrix and then the cofactors of that matrix. That's all. Thank you for listening.